And hey guys, how you doing? My name is John, Gamester81, and welcome to episode 93. We're recording this live. It is Wednesday, what is today, the 9th? And we are recording live, so it's good to be here. I'm with my good friend, Jason Heine, the EMA Review. What's up, Jason? What up, guys? Welcome to the live stream. And I am here also with Pete Dorr. Pete, Obi-Wan Kenobi Dorr, correct? <laughs> Is that, your, is that the deal? How are you doing? I guess it sounds, yeah, it sounds about right. I'm doing good. <laughs> and we are also with Metal Jesus Rocks. Jason, how's it going? I'm getting ready. Do you want to hear? <laughs> nice. What are you drinking? <laughs> what are you sipping on? This is not a DVD. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what are you sipping on? That is going to be uh, Bodington's Pub Ale. Mm. Drinking yeah, a little bit of that. that. That's that. smooth. I really like that. Stuff. Daddy's that's cough smooth. syrup. I'm ready for the live, the live show. Absolutely. Now, now, Jason, how many live shows have you joined us with? Is this the first one or second one? Second. Okay. Yeah, because my, my first official uh, podcast was a live one, right? Yes, I think that's correct. It was, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. And we're also a joint. Now, this guy. I just discovered recently through uh, through Mel Jesus, and I've been watching his videos. Really impressed. Yeah, and his name is Dustin. He goes by Video Game Sauce. I really highly, highly recommend you guys check out his show. And Dustin, how's it going? Oh, I'm very well, guys. I'm I'm blushing. <laughs> Internet <laughs> blushing. Yeah, Dustin, it's very good to be here. <laughs> I've noticed you have a lot. I mean, you have a very fondness for the 2600 and for ColecoVision. So, so I, I'm assuming Retro is kind of in your heart, correct? Oh yeah, definitely. Love uh-huh. the vision. What is it about these systems that really you're fond of? I like that they're they're very basic and very simplistic, and they're very fun. It it, it breaks it down to the most basic level, and it's brilliant. Mm. Yeah. It is true. So, as yeah. an all gen gamers tradition, mm. the question to you, Dustin: What is your favorite game of all time? Ooh, you know what I knew was coming up today, and I thought about it. <laughs> and that's that's a that's a really a tough one. But it is, yeah. it's 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 a split between three games, and I had to pick. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Bioshock. Mm. Mm-hmm. Awesome. It's good. Uh, it's very good. So have you heard that? I'm sorry. Have you heard the news that Bioshock Infinite is delayed until February of 2013? Yes, I, I read that today, and I was really I was a little bit saddened because I love all things Bioshock. Yeah, although th- there is something to be said for not trying to compete with all the other games during Christmas, too, you know? So hopefully that'll work in its favor. So, Pete, when is that supposed to come out? 2013 when? February, uh, February 2013. I think there's an exact date, but I know it's February. Hmm. hmm. Now, Dustin, you do a really hilarious video for, I think it's B17, the, the speech module. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you caught that one, did you? <laughs> that is one of the funniest videos I've seen in a long time. No lie. I was cracking up. What uh, what, ins- what inspired you to do that? You know, I don't know. I, I was going over YouTube, just looking at uh, random and television videos, games, and because I've been thinking about buying one. And I came across B-17 Bomber. And it, for some reason, it stuck in my craw. It's just being that, that little dialogue at the beginning just stuck with me and I was like you know what I'm going to try something a little different that I usually don't do and just act like a complete idiot <laughs> and yeah it's one of those videos you, you can't really explain you just have to watch it but I don't yeah. know for some reason it's just stuck with me it's just being weird especially you know dialogue spoken dialogue on an old in television I just is I don't know I find it uh kind of funny it was incredible yeah. back in the day though Oh yeah, big time. Same with Odyssey too, voice modulator that they had for that too. I was just blown away. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember the, the first time I heard voice I, on my Commodore sixty four. It was a game called uh, uh, Ghostbusters, and that's all I do is just go Ghostbusters. <laughs> <laughs> and I would sit there and hit the space bar listening to that over and over again. It just blew my my little mind, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm. The old digitized voices. Yeah. Now you um you also you you have a really interesting way of of doing videos and video reviews. I, I, I was hoping you'd kind of explain the method to your madness because, for instance, your your most current Miss Pac-Man video, 
it's it's so <laughs> it's so random and and funny because you have like lounge music in the background it's like this happy lounge music uh then you also have a uh <laughs> you have a shot of a master chief in a tutu <laughs> or in a dress <laughs> <laughs> um <clears throat> what what inspired all that I don't know. I think most of my, I just, I make videos that really reflect my personality and I have a bit of a quirky sense of humor and I love Miss Pac-Man, you know, and I was like, I want to try something different instead of, you know, because Miss Pac-Man is brewed and viewed a lot. And, you know, I was like, you know, I'm going to throw some lounge music in there. (laughs) I started people, make people think of a lounge, you know, drinking and just having fun. And yeah, somehow I ended up comparing or no, yeah, I ended up saying because Miss Pac-Man was unlicensed. I said, you know, it's like nowadays if they took Halo and then just called it Miss Halo, and you know, Master Chief had you know wore a dress. You know, it's like yeah. <laughs> it, it's yeah, it's one of those things. Like you have to watch it to kind of get there to go. Oh, okay, now I get it. <laughs> yeah. No, it was very funny. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. There's a joke in there somewhere, Gamestar eighty one, about Miss Pac-Man, right? Oh, the, the fact that you hooked up with her, I think, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I wasn't going to say anything, but I thought you wanted to keep that secret. But... Stop! <laughs> oh, my God. She has a big mouth, you know. I know. Yeah. Like that, so. Something about eating. Oh, I'll just leave her on. <laughs> no she has legs, then she doesn't have legs. She has legs. No eating legs. a lot of balls, oh, you know, I don't know. The car- <laughs> Remember the cartoon show Pac-Man? Like, didn't they give her legs and they had a kind of a family? Remember that? Oh, yeah. No, she was. Re- <laughs> yeah, she was. Yeah. She's walking around. She had a little bow in there, you know. Air. Looking good. You know, they're bringing back a Pac Man show, I think. Are they? Later this year. Yeah. It's going to be, uh, it's not going to be cartoon, but it's going to be 3D animated. But yeah, Pac Man is coming back. Hmm. Pac is back. Pac is back. <laughs> nice. Uh-huh. That's cool. Nice. Very cool. What's your guys' favorite uh, Pac Man game, though? Ms. Pac Man. Pac-Man? On the Genesis. Okay. Hmm. Uh, I like... Oh, oh, go ahead. No, please. After you, Jesus. <laughs> I was going to say, I like the I like Miss Pac-Man as well, but it's that fast version of it, and I don't know if that's an arcade. We could have gone at the same time, because that's mine too. Yeah. Yep. You just you get in the zone with that game, you know? I believe they call it like a speed hack or something, but I know that every arcade I go to now, that's what's there. So hmm. I don't know. If I, I think it's just a dip switch that they just switch and. Oh, is that what it is? Okay, I, yeah. I think so. I think that's any Miss Pac-Man or I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's that's the case. But man, when so. you play it like that, it just you just can't go back to the the way it originally was, in my yeah. opinion. So so Jason, you like Mrs. Pac-Man fast? Oh God, here we go, <laughs> ladies like, and gentlemen. <laughs> you like it fast? Games to Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> nice. She's quick. <laughs> yeah, I love Miss Pac-Man. I probably have to say that's probably my favorite. But I'll, I'll be honest. Oh, I love Junior Pac-Man too, and that's kind of an overlooked Pac-Man. Um, it's got a big maze. It was it scrolls, mm-hmm. and a really great port of that uh, I have for the twenty six hundred, which I think is a like um, it was never released. I think it would have a no, no, it was released. I'm thinking of Super Pac-Man that I have that for. But anyway, Junior Pac-Man is awesome for the twenty six hundred. Really good. Yeah, port. It, it's a, a late release, right? It's like uh, it? late eighties. Yeah, but back at a classic gaming expo a couple years ago, I picked up Super Pac Man for the twenty six hundred, which wasn't officially released, but uh, I got that, and that's a really good port too. Mm. How about you, Justin? Oh, you know what? I and I haven't played it. Well, I have played it via emulators, but this Pac Man on the seventy eight hundred that that was pretty cool, pretty well done actually. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, you know what? Combat Kid just reminded me Ch- Championship uh, DX. Oh, Pac Man yeah. is probably my favorite. Yeah, it's good. That's a great one. Is that the that's the newer one, right? That's the newer one. Oh yeah, it's fantastic. You know, there's a there's a, a newer one in the arcades, a four player, right? Oh, I've seen that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I played that. Yeah, it's, that's good uh, too. If it wasn't so goddamn expensive to play it, I'd be there all day. But holy god, is it fun! Yeah. Basically, it's uh, I think they just call it flat out Pac Man versus or mm-hmm. Pac Man. I don't know. I forget the exact name, but. Yeah, you just everybody plays as a Pac-Man, and um, there's no ghosts, but you get pellets and you get big, and then you have to try and eat the other Pac-Mans. It's and, basically hmm. like elimination. 
Yeah, yeah. it's so much fun. They've got cup holders on there, beautiful cabinet, very nice. Yeah, it's like a like cocktail it. kind of table, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Make sure to follow us, the All Gen Gamers podcast, on Facebook and Twitter. Subscribe to us on YouTube and in iTunes. And don't forget about those iTunes ratings, guys. We appreciate those. And for all other info, links, and our forum, please visit www.allgengamers.com.